Okay. Okay. We should be back now. I just had to manually reset it. How we looking? Are we all right? <laughs> we hanging in there? Says I'm online. Yep. Okay. Good. It still shows me on the battle. So it should be good now. Hi. Hello. All right. We're back. Yeah. It looks like it was just a hiccup in the internet. Not sure what that was. Uh, a bit of a bummer. I had to stop the local recording too, which sucks. <laughs> Cause uh, I. Hallelujah. We're back. I had to stop the local recording too, uh, so there's gonna be like a, like a jump cut, I guess. And I'm not huge on taking care of that, but it is what it is. Stinky internet, yeah. Can't keep me down, but it can keep itself down. <laughs> yeah, I figured I'd try it. Oh, what is this big boy? Is it like a Cyclops dragon with a mouth on its back and... F What's going on with its feet? I'm very confused. This is a very strange creature. It scares me. Oh, it's like a heel? Not sure what that is. Oh. Ow. The, the giant mouth sucks. It's really gross. Ah, here we go. Ugh. Recover HP and status ally okay that's kind of cool here let's use it on her see what happens wow that's like a really good heal too on uh, unironically might be a better heal than heal there we go Caravan, what do you got? Man, y'all are boring. Y'all just got the same shit. Ooh, ship graveyard? Uh, I don't know if this is where I need to go. Serenade? Uh, is that it? Yeah, that's for you. 
Cool. I love this little little tune they got going on here. There we go. Trying to cross the inner sea, but no ships have come in days. Is it the monsters? Yeah, probably. Oh, you know what? Hang on. Hey, you love to see it. What do you got going on? Eh, same shit, different day. Ooh, got some good shit here. Cheek Bolero. See, this is nice, but I don't... I'm not going to use it, because the ones I have give me more stats. And I always want more stats. And the goat dolls I honestly don't need. Like, I, I'm not going to die. Ugh. It's so difficult. See, this is kind of fucked up. This is just like free heal for everyone and a any ailments they have. All right, this I don't need. I'm not going to do it. And I'm not going to do this either. I'm just not going to need either one. All right. Um. Yeah. That's pretty good. Yes, please. Yo, the stats. Let's go. Oh my God. These stats are so good. These stat increases are fucking narbars, dude. So ready for these? Oh, I don't I don't think that's enough. Oh, it's just barely enough. Yes. Wow. Look at this shit. This is like this town is busted. Love this town. What a great town. Hey. I left Anna there at the pleasing garden. I was a hotshot dream chaser back then. It was after the sword called the Guardian Blade. Out of lust for the sword, I, my wife Anna, as you can see, I can no longer walk. Will you please retrieve my wife's bracelet from the pleasing garden? I want to give my wife a proper burial. Damn, dude. Yeah, I mean, I'll do it, but...
the extreme chaser Dan and his wife challenged the pleasing garden in the desert. They were separated in the maze, and Dan was the only one who came back. He was injured, and so he started a life here. The maze of mirages inside the pleasing garden is a maze of illusions. To dispel the illusion, you must retrace the path that you have already traveled. I've also heard that at the second cross section, you must walk straight through and then go left on the way back. I wonder why. Yeah, I'm not. I'm, uh, hang on. I, one more time. And then... I'm t if you're wondering, I'm taking screenshots of this so I have it. All right, there we go. Yo, Sapphire, hello. Welcome. You're catching wild arms. We're chilling with wild arms. The docks are just ahead. They look deserted, though. Yeah. Uh, no, I do not. The inner sea currents bring a lot of debris to this region. These currents wash debris from shipwrecks onto the shores of this town. Because of this, a passing dream chaser nicknamed this town Ship Graveyard. The name stuck. Now only a few remember the town's original name. You have a customer or what? Oh, I don't I don't have like any money, dude, sorry. A lucky cat. This town is full of fish. This desolate harbor used to be bustling with merchants. Well, not so bustling now. Alright. I think I got what I needed, which is like a hint. I got to like freshen up on uh, health and whatnot, so kind of works out. Hang on, what does this say? You can't blame those who run away, but sometimes it's important to stick it out. I have no idea what I'm looking for. Or... Um... Dan Scissor? 
That's just a scorpion with a, a mace on its tail. Oh my god! Nice amount of damage. Alright, now let's just whoop this guy's butt. Hang on, I had some apples. Yeah. to see it. There we go. Um, hmm. Oh, I looked away for two seconds. I was checking my phone. I didn't mean to. Oh, um, okay. Very confused. I don't know what I'm doing here. Why are there scorpions? Is there, like, a secret in here somewhere? Nope. Oh, what? Excuse me? What the fuck? Um... Okay? I don't know... I'm very confused. I mean, they're worth a lot of experience, so I'm not like too upset. this oh god damn it that one looked different oh my god that chicken got Crispy.
Yep, roasted him. Oh. What the fuck? I have no idea what this is. I don't know if I'm even going the right way, but I assume a save point is a good thing. Uh... Okay. Okay. God damn it. Oh my god, the encounter rate here is fucking massive. Dude, I don't care. I just don't care. Get out of here, you shitty antlion. Why are you healing? You're at max health. You literally can't heal. You wasted your entire fucking turn on that. He's like, ah, shit. I'm just, like, I'm very paranoid, and I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh? <sighs> Elf. Okay, see, now that was a smart move, because he had damage dealt to him. But it didn't matter, because uh, he's going to fucking die. And that's just how it is. Yep, later, man. Uh... 
Do I portal left or do I portal right? A portal right. Oh, I just realized I it, that brings me in like a circle, right? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I was I was going left earlier. Maybe I'll go left again. Frowless? Frowless. What are these like? These are like goopy dogs? What are these? Yep, good camera angle. Oh! Jesus! Watch the fuck out. I'm coming. Come for that ass. Uh... I wonder what fire does to this guy. A lot. It does a lot. Smart move. Smart move. Didn't matter, because I outdid most of it with... Actually, I just outdid all of it. You know, you're dead. Nice. Oh. Button. I like button. Oh yeah, that's just a torch. Oh wait a minute, those buttons are for those like purple thingies, right? The ones that like go up and down or whatever. Hang on, I'm gonna read that hint again. What did that hint say? To dispel the illusion, you must retrace the path that you've already traveled. I've also heard that at the second cross section, you must walk straight through and go left on the way back. What? Zero armor? Oh! Jesus! was a rather visceral hit. Make sure they, uh, they don't dodge it. Wait, do they have two tails? 
or is that just like a poop? Because they have the t the chicken tail, but then they have like a snake tail. It's very, very poor, oh, very poor character design. I feel like the menacing music and everything implies that I need to like, yeah, I need to get ready for this. Oh, Jesus. Nice. Oh, I'm as ready as I'll ever be. Oh, yo, big boy, very big boy. The shit was that noise. Damn it, no! I didn't mean to heal Rudy, he already has max health. Oh hey, worked out. Oh my god, that really worked out for me. Literally healed back exactly what he dealt. Nice. Actually, hang on. I wonder if that thing has any items. We need to lower this dude's bullshit. This dude sucks. Has nothing. Great. I don't think it did anything. It didn't tell me. that noise. That noise sucks. That's a bad noise. It's very loud and obnoxious. So much damage. Sorry, Cecilia, you're stuck on you're stuck on heal duty. God, that noise sucks. Shout out to two two three, which is just one one two plus one. All right, this turn. Uh, hey, 
Yo! Welcome, uh, Loveless TV. Welcome. All time favorite game? Yo, let's go. Yes. Pleasing Garden. Um. Oh my god, this goddamn screaming sucks. <laughs> Yes, there we go. Ba-doom! That helps a little bit. And then... You know what? Let's see what fire does. You're a giant mantis, so I imagine fire is good on you. Oh! Ooh, that was really not good. Okay, next time I'm using Mystic and uh, like a Potion Berry. I did an alright amount. Okay, so... Uh, Mystic... Do it. Yo, wait. Nice! I didn't even need to do that. Because I won. Let's go. Let's go. Oof. 3,000. Let's go. Oh, GG, easy, yeah. <laughs> and now I carry the head of my enemies with me wherever I go. That's kind of fucked up that I use his head to activate the switch. Ooh, what is this? Ooh, grapple? There are many things you can hook onto. Give it a try. Sick. Yo, nice. Alright guys, we don't need the sinister music, it's gone. Um... You know what? I didn't check out... Here. What's in here? I saw that earlier and I was like, I don't know... Oh! Cool. It brought me back here. I'm assuming the grapple is what I need. I wish I had, like, a heal all for the party. That'd be very helpful. sworn that was... Oh, maybe this is the exit. I got a couple small items and then the grapple hook, so I think that's all. She wrote? Wasn't there a guy in the town that was like, oh, my 
my dead wife as a thing here. Uh, well, I mean, I'll I'll take those too. Uh, I don't think his dead wife was looking for a crest graph. Yo, miss encounter. Let's go. I feel like that's the first counter attack I've gotten in a very long time. Oof. Not good. Oh, hey. Yeah, it worked out. God, this music's great. Um, let's see. I forget which one was... I think it's the heat? Yeah. There we go. Probably a good thing I have this now, because... I do not want to have to fight the Mantis again. That screaming was hurting my ears. <laughs> I went the other direction earlier. are really like oh yo let's go i can actually use it oh no oh don't make me pick uh uh oh yo Clued you into this game? It's one of the less popular PS1 RPG. Well, that's the thing. Uh, I've always known about Wild Arms since uh, I want to say like 2012, 2013, when I first discovered the Completionist, and he always used Wild Arms music in his videos, and so I've been like a like a passive fan. Like I've 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 literally never beaten any of the games. So, you know, I'm just finally now getting around to playing them myself. I have I have all of them. Uh, I don't have the remake uh, or the tactic game, though. Oh, yeah, and the soundtracks are fucking premium, dude. Um, oh, you know what? Since I have favorite game of all time person here, um, was there is there anything else in this place I should go get? Or... Should I go back to that intersection with the other portals? Or is there, like, nothing there? Yo, Hydrate? I can do that. Thanks, hon.
Oh, Jesus. It's quite a bit of replays. But hey, if it's your favorite game, I feel it. This game is fucking dope. I think my only gripe, and it's super small, but my only gripe with it thus far has been that some of the... Uh, I get confused on like some of the stats and stuff like that. That's about it. But other than that, I've had a great time with it. It's like weirdly like simple, but also complex. I like it. Like it's not option overload, you know? Yeah, it's, but that's the thing. This was like the first like big time RPG they made. So I can, I can understand. I think the only like RPG they did beforehand was uh, Crime Crackers. And like that's kind of not an RPG, but is. And they also went on to make uh, Valkyria Chronicles 3 and 4. So. Oh yeah, and I, it does have the equipment changing thing. I mean, I haven't really needed to use that though because I just, my party's buff as hell all the time. <laughs> but it is cool you can do it. I, I think the only RPG I know of that does it is uh, maybe, well, well like, like you were saying, strategy games like Fire Emblem, but um, like maybe FF10. I think that's that's one where you can like swap your sword around and stuff. Jeez, Jack. Why do you get hit with all the freaking ailments? <laughs> Sucks. <laughs> Uh, no, we gotta, we gotta get rid of that. We don't like that. Not in this house. Wanting to replay FF10? Only played it once and that was in 2015. It's a great game. Love FF10. FF10 is probably my second favorite in the Final Fantasy series. I think, uh, 9 is the only one above it. And then four is around there too, because I it's just personal. I like that one a lot. Whoa! What the fuck? What the shit? Oh my god. That was awful. I hated that. <laughs> I swear I'll get into Final Fantasy one day. Don't worry, when you move in, you will have no choice but to play nothing but Persona and Final Fantasy. <laughs> That's what you have to look forward to. Non-stop 30 plus hour RPGs. At a minimum. God, this encounter rate! <laughs> Get stopped! <laughs> I believe in you, Chess. Yo, Loveless, let's go with the support. Let's go. <laughs> oh, yeah, we need to. Jack got freaking mollywopped in that. <laughs> with that drain move. Oh, nice. An illegally good OST? Yeah, it did. Well, I haven't played Eternal Punishment yet. I'm waiting for the the PSP Fran translation to get finished, and then I'm going to hop into it. Because I want... I want to... Two is my... Innocent Sin is my second favorite in the series. So, like, I want to play them both back-to-back -back in PSP form and not switch between PS1 and, you know... All right, let's get rid of that little guy over there. <laughs> Thank you for not making heal the first move you did. <laughs> Your heal didn't matter. Oh, 
RPG overload. Uh, it's not overload. It'll you'll you'll be able to break up the monotony with uh. Hmm. No, it's gonna be RPG overload. Sorry, hon. That's how it is. <laughs> okay, so what were the po what was the point of the left and right portals if they just lead me to the middle one again? Goodbye, world. All right, let's go hook Dan up with his uh, dead wife's bracelet. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go. Where's the inn? Inn's around here. Yeah, there it is. Dan and his wife made a gamble. They sure did. Uh, her, her name is Anna. A N N A. Thank you. This is the bracelet I gave to my wife. You found it for me in the garden? If only we had the sense to distinguish between courage and stupidity. My wife's death taught me a harsh lesson about what's truly precious. Courage and stupidity. Many think that courage is power. Real power is when you surpass your own desires to protect something dear. Courage slowly builds up inside Jack. Yo, what? Sonic Vision. Let's go. So the merchant ship is here. Now we can cross the inner sea. The tide washes up debris from all over the inner sea. Just recently, the remains of a ghost ship washed up on the beach. Can't go yet. Let's check this thing out. Okay. Well, I think I know where to go now. Uh, I'm going to save, just in case. You never save enough. Uh, what would you say, what would you say, like, lengthwise, like, how far into the game am I right now? Am I, like, 50%? 40 percent 60 I know I ain't 90%. <laughs> Hooray for convenient NPC chatter! Very convenient. Ooh, buy fruit, toy hammer, I guess? Don't know why that was here. The ship is finally here, but the current also brought a ghost ship. I can see it from here. There is a ghost ship coming this way. Okay. Less than halfway. Okay. Eh, that's understandable. I play it in about three to four hour sessions every time. So I'm not making like huge progress every time. Oh, it's like Chrono Trigger and Scale. Got it. Probably didn't want to see our captain again. But if the situation gets any worse, we'll go out of business. Please help us. With what? What am I helping you with? Oh, hey, it's the boy. You guys always seem to appear when I need you. My soulmates. Can you guys give me a hand again, please? I want you to get rid of this ghost ship that's frightening everyone at the port. 30 to 40 hours. Oh, not a lot of side content, but what is there is substantial. Yeah. If you succeed, people at the port will be happy again. We'll be able to resume that trade. Of course, you'll be known as the dream chasers who saved the port. You see, it's a win-win situation. Isn't that a great plan? Hey, no hurry. You need to make some preparations first. Come back when you're ready. I mean... Want to play as Rudy? And I'm ready. Let's do it. We'll transfer from the sweet candy to the ghost ship. 
Calling it the sweet candy just reminds me of uh, sweet stuff from Wario Land Shake It. It is dead silent. <laughs> Why is it so quiet? What happened? Uh, come back to the boat if you get in trouble. Uh, we'll be waiting here. Alright, well. Jelly boys? Deteriorated from long-term exposure to sea air. Neat. There we go. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. Am I able to... Oh, wait, but I can... Yeah! Big brain. Let's go. Go, Caitlyn. Christine? Wait, that's a reference to something, right? Jesus, Jack, chill. Oh my god, why do you why do we deal so much damage to these things? Rudy, this was so unwarranted. I thought they'd be stronger. This room. Ah, here we go. Secret sign. What is that to again? Oh. Right, okay, so I use this one a lot. And I'm I don't really use the other ones. I mean they're all good though, but you know. Just the more I can use Meteor Dive the better, you know. There we go. Because realistically, that's what I use. It's it's these three I'm going to be using, so. Oh, you know what would have been cool if I, if they thought of this back in the day, but like setting your like equipment to the right stick would have been like a real oh well no playstation this game came out when they didn't have that yet though so never mind i was gonna say like if they could map that to the right stick that would be really nice <laughs> yeah this was yeah 96 Why are vampires just these, like, shitty anorexic rats? <laughs> what are... Oh my god, he's schmoovin'. The long game cases? Uh, no. I See, I was born in 93, so that was, like... I didn't get into PlayStation until, like, 2000. Like, I, I was really late to PlayStation, so I only ever knew about the jewel cases. I just remember 
trying Ape Escape in, uh, at my my cousin's place. And, and then the others, like FF7 and Metal Gear Solid, like other iconic ones, right? But like, that's what sold me on PlayStation. I never even knew about Wild Arms till way later. This came out when I was 11? Damn. So long ago. Oh. So. I gotta come around. I'm only slightly nostalgic right now. Only slightly. Understandable. It's a good game. Good game to be nostalgic for. Oh, what is this? Logbook. There's a piece of paper folded in the book. The stuff the stuff is hit behind a hidden door. No one knows about the hidden switch on the side of the bed. Looking for... Uh... There no switch? <laughs> That's it? No switch? This place has to be dusty as hell, right? Like, this is not... Like, clean. Let me die. I don't want to be a pirate anymore. Let me out of this darkness. Oh my god! I was wondering why he was talking. What the fuck? Cybergeist? What? Uh, okay, dude. Oof. He did a pretty good amount of damage. Jesus, smoke that dude, and it was worth so much. Alas, nothing. All right, one of these fucking beds better have this, or I'm going to scream. The dead do not speak. Then why'd you let me... T whatever. Shut up. The way I went. We are men of the sea. Pirating and smuggling is our life. We'll still be able to fight, even if we get shaved down to our bones. What other PS1 RPGs? Um, I enjoyed FF7. Uh, I actually didn't beat that until early last year, um, where I like modded the PC version, made it look a little prettier, um, but and like cleaned up some of the janky stuff, like some materia not working correctly. But other than that, it was the same game. Um, and then, um, ooh, Switch, nice. Um, and then, uh, big fan of FF9, I mentioned that one, um, and then, uh, didn't know until recently that Magic Defense doesn't exist in, yeah, yeah, it doesn't exist, it's not a thing, <laughs> it's very weird. Um, and then I've, I've played Revelations Persona a little bit. But it was... I, the Americanization throws me off, so it was difficult. <laughs> um, and then, not, you know, literally difficult, but it was just, it was tough to sit through. Um, but I never beat it. And then uh, Persona 2, Innocent Sin. Um, I haven't played, like, a lot of other ones. Or at least not that I can think of off the top of my head. If you say some, I might be like, oh yeah, that one, but... 
off the top of my head, I can't really think of anything else. I'm assuming you're like a big RPG nut, though. Oh. <gasps> Yo, what the fuck? Parasite Eve Xenogears? Uh, nope. Heard of them. I, I own them. Don't have them. I hate you. What? <laughs> Definitely a JRPG fan. Hell yeah. Oh, Cecilia's just kind of taking a nap right now. Oh no, she's not going to get an experience for this. Pretty short. 20 hours? Xenogears. Oh, okay. Uh, do, do characters gain experience if they die? Yo, shout out to 112. Good friend. They are a cool person. I don't think dead characters do. Okay. Now I know. No, oh, what the fuck? I want over there. Give me that. How do I do that? You know what? Hang on. Prism Ray, and then you are immediately meteor blading that guy. That guy sucks. Um. Yeah, just throw out a flame. Yes, thank you, game. I know that there's treasure in those treasure chests. How do I get there? Maybe I, like, fall down from above? Is there, like, a way for me to do that? Not these guys. Alright, these guys, I'm using this fucking move. Here. I'm blocking with you, Cecilia. We're not risking shit. Jeez, even blocking it, it does damage. Let's go. Tons of money and experience. I feel like I'm, like, cheating or something. Like, what, what happened? Like... Like, not long ago, I was maybe getting a couple hundred for enemies and stuff, but now I'm just, like, living large. <laughs> yep, there. Thanks. This started from the bottom, now we're here. Yeah, that's what it is, though, for real. Oh, nice. Ooh, nice. I accidentally used a bunch of those on the Mantis earlier, so I kind of appreciate getting more of those now. Oof! The crit. 
Let's go. Is there like a... I wonder if there's like a specific thing I need to do to reach those three down there. Can I come back to Ghost Ship later? Is that like a thing I can do? Come back? Oh, so I gotta like, I gotta get those or else. But that's the thing. Can I get those with my... I'm not gonna... Backseat spoil stuff? Just gonna... No, that's fine. That's fine. I actually appreciate that. Like, if I ask for help, then, you know, feel free to say your piece. But, yeah. So, am I able to get those? Or was that just like a... Because those were blue. And I'm not used to blue treasure in this game. It's only been purple, if, as far as I'm aware. The fact they gave me a save point worries me. Ooh. Not now. No, don't worry about those. Okay. You got them. Ocean Bear. Nice. Oh yeah, that's uh that's a boss right there. Captain Geist! Really? The dead will roam the wasteland now. Celebrate our glory with your lives. <laughs> Captain Geist. Alright. Let's see how you handle basic attacks. Uh, do you need to use a lucky card on each character, or does just lucky card mean at the end of battle it'll double it? Like a card, whole part. Cool. Nice. Oh, geez. Oh, you know what? Here, we're gonna have Rudy do it, because it's gonna skip Cecilia's turn anyway. So, we're gonna have Rudy do this, and then you can focus on the hitting. Yeah. Vanishing Buster Anchor? Oh my god! Damn. That was a lot. Chill out, dude. I thought we were cool. I thought we were friends. What happened? Yeah, let's do that too. Why not? Just pile it on. Yeah. Oh no, it didn't work. God, this dude's just going ham on Jack. Oh, actually, you know what? Cecilia can probably. There. 
It's a better heal than the berry is. Oof, nice. Oh my god, dude. Why does your anchor move not even deal close to the same amount of damage? party why would you why would you waste your turn doing that oh sick all right he just wasted a bunch of turns doing stun cloud I guess You know what? Yeah. Oh wait, no. You have uh, your fucking condition green thing. That'll just... You'll come back. You'll be fine. Until then, I'll just deal damage. You love to see it. Let's go. Thirty four hundred, baby. Let's go. Oh, my. Oh, my God. It's so much. It's so much gala. What the fuck? Fifteen thousand six hundred. Let's go. Okay, great. We're done. <laughs> and we're not going to talk about it. <laughs> Big more. Big monies. You're rich. Damn. Yeah, look at that. 46k? Damn. Rocking it. Let's go. I was like, what the fuck? I'm still worried about those. I can't pick these up, right? Nope. There's there's gotta be something in this room. I'm I'm going fucking bonkers here. I don't Thanks, video game. <laughs> oh, 
Bum bum, ba dum bum 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 bum. All right. Um. And then, boom, boom, boom. All right, there we go. Someday she'll get the we'll get the butt shake again. We haven't gotten the butt shake since like the first stream. It was very funny. The little booty 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 dance. over leveled I, f I feel like i'm not having like a lot of issues in this game and i feel like that's because i'm over leveled like am i too good at wild arms see there's i feel like i'm missing something Totally unnecessary. Glad it worked out. are not going to be in, in Rush Hour 3. Uh, can they? Yeah, they can. Okay. And then, oh. Charge up. Oh no. How many dolls are on this ship? What were these pirates up to?
Yep. Thank you, game. These schmoobin' rats, they're so funny. Can't get over their sick dance moves. Oh my god, no! Oh, okay, that wasn't... Yeah, that wasn't as scary as I thought it'd be. But it, I mean, it wasn't good, but, you know. It certainly wasn't the fucking 280 from one guy that that one creature did. She was doing the dance. God damn it. I missed it. I'm so pissed. She was doing the dance. Oh, what the fuck? Cool. Is that it? What were those blue chests for? I feel like I'm missing something. So confused. It was very funny. Thanks. I guess I'm just not going to find out what those blue ones do. Oh. Goodbye, JPEG of a boat. I hardly knew ye. You guys have helped me not once, but twice. My pride and honor tells me to give you the use of my ship. This will allow you to travel the inner sea. By the way, why are you guys traveling around Fulgaia anyway? They told Bartholomew the entire story. The demons, the guardians, the stolen teardrop. Wow, I had no idea something like that was happening. But it sounds exciting. Let me and the sweet candy take care of the sea. Captain, I have a favor to ask. 
I'm from Metalhide, and the town was destroyed by monsters? Want to go and rebuild it? That's right, you were an architect. Don't worry about us, we'll be fine. Go forward and uh, build your town. Sorry, I was reading two things at once. Uh, thanks for everything. I'm in your debt. Later, dude. Good boy. He's a very talented person. He'll probably make Adelheid better than it was before. Okay, we'll make preparations for departure. We'll meet you at the beach. Outside of town. Cool. So, I can just... I can just rock it with a boat now. Sweet. I'm gonna hop on in. Oh! Huh. Breast graph, goat doll, wind vane. So that's where they went. Avoid surprise attacks 100%. Yo! No more ambushes. That is pretty nice. I get more magic. Uh, is there a magic shop in the town? Actually, yes, there is. Okay, thank God. I like being this rude. Absorb MP. Cast evil on a weapon. Overcome with anger. Cast holy. Decrease encounter rate. Oh, I want decrease encounter rate, please. Blind, spiritual attack random, prevent magic use on from a group, nullify magic spell on an enemy, imprison, wind, confuse, sleep. I have spark for now. Oh, that's silence. Um, nullify magic spell? Is that like... Is that like uh, get rid of their buffs if they have any? So indecisive. No, I'm not going to use that. You know what? I'll take wind. It's always good. It's always good to have more elements.
what that sounds actually. Pretty good. Don't call it suction. It's such a bad name. Wrong way. Sad to see an empty arbor. What? He said the beach, but. Mm. Oh, did he mean like on the world map? Supposed to go? Yo, this music though? Oh, there are random encounters on the sea. I knew it. <laughs> oh my god. Ballot fish. Yo, the this fish was the <laughs> winner for the Smash Wii U ballot. Watch out. Ooh. Oh my god, that was a lot. Shit, get wrecked. Damn, that dude on the right did not survive. He's gone. He's gone. Later. Oh, can't go through whirlpools, I guess. crab <laughs> they're wearing glasses why are they wearing glasses they're the coolest fucking crabs on planet earth <laughs> oh 
Damn, dude, they are roasting Cecilia. Oh, that did nothing? Wild. Well, let's see what this does. Ooh, dodge. Let's go. God, fuck these crabs, dude. These crabs suck. And... Whoa, nice. Oof. God. That zero armor attack enemies have now is just, just... Just fuck. That's, the move sucks. I hate it. It does so much damage. I can assume what it does is like... You know, oh, I can ignore your defense when I hit. But like... Damn, dude. I hate getting fucking wrecked by it. It's not fun. Damn it. Oh, wait. Aren't I supposed to go, like, north to, like, a snow place or something? ever getting in a fight with me. For a thousand gala, we can change your name to a brand new one. What? Oh, like the character names? Interesting. Alright, well, no, I'm good, but it's very funny that you offer that service. Thank you. <laughs> you should pick a better location, bud. Ooh, sirens. Here, I'm just gonna... No chances. <laughs> Gela Eater? Oh no! Don't eat my money! Oh, that was fucking nothing. Maelstrom. Oh no. Nice. I don't know why they gave me an antidote. They don't even poison me. They confused me. Why does a pinwheel cure confusion? <laughs> I've never asked that until now. Uh, tri pillar? Okay. Uh, sure. Three roads. Cooperation and trust will bind them into one. Oh. I think this is showing us how to climb the tower. This must mean each of us has to go up separately in order to reach the top. I know it sounds dangerous, but we must separate from here on. God damn it. Um, powerful magic has sealed the blue door. I don't know 
Who goes where? Am I in the center? Uh, saved recently? Yeah, before I left the town. Uh, and before I got on the boat, I saved. Is it, like, rough here? This is the only place you can soft lock? Oh, shit. Damn, dude. I don't like that. You pick the wrong path for someone, no big deal, just load the save. Okay. Oh. Well, potion berry. Nice. Damn, if I have to reload the save, I have to go all the way back. Jeez. Maybe I should... If I have to reload the save, I'm going to be very <laughs> upset, truth be told. Yell them. See what this does. What is that? Okay. All right, Gremlin. First time I did four digits. Oh, this is that shitty life stealing move. Oh my god, it failed! Let's go! So, how do I know whose path is what? Like, I just. I picked the right path for Jack because that's how the game set us up, but. not signal to you directly. Uh, you hit a point where you can't progress, reload, and choose a different character for the route. Huh. 
Well, if it ha if it happens again, you know, well, I'll try and get a closer save spot. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah, just get rid of these guys real quick. Oh, oh don't. I hate that move. It's so bad. God, not again. Hate you. <laughs> Get out of here. Is this it? Did I do it? Uh, would you happen to know... Who's cool with what path? <laughs> uh, I'll be honest, like, soft locking would really upset me, especially after I just did all that. Because it, it broke us up with Rudy in the middle, Jack on the right, and Cecilia on the left. So I assume, is that like the game subtly hinting that's how you're supposed to do this? Knowing my luck, it'll be like Cecilia to the north or something like that. Jack went right, so if Rudy goes up, then, or if Rudy goes left, excuse me, then I'm gonna soft lock? I don't think so? Okay. So Cecilia up, though. Okay. Oh, ah, damn, that sucks. Yeah, that sucks, but okay, if I'm only missing a fast draw, then like I'm not the most upset I could be. Because, <laughs> like, I'll be real, Meteor Dive is just going to be my go to move for the rest of the game. thing on the ground is a teleport so you could swap oh so so wait there isn't a soft lock because if i can teleport out oh well assuming they get to the end of it i didn't know this until now not gonna lie well there you go gg well, i guess that means i can get the fast draw then i just have to do the route again but i don't mind doing that tbh TBH, do not mind.
Yo, I got the dance. Look at the cutie dance. She's doing her best. So, uh, are you... I'm assuming you're, like, a fan of the series then, right? Like, it's not just the first game? Oh, first two, not the rest. Got it. Because I, I was going to say, uh, in the... They remade this game for P... Oh, yo! There it goes again. Yo, twice? Twice in a row? Let's go. Um, I wonder if the remake brings back her, her dance. It'd be very cute. But, like, no one talks about the remake, so... <laughs> like, the series is already pretty, like, not talked about. <laughs> and so, like, the, the remake that sold, like, three copies. Like, probably, probably not it. Started it, stopped at Lulukia's tomb. Weird, because that's actually where I stopped. I've played the remake before, but I stopped at Lulukia's tomb as well. God damn it, the gremlin sounds like a cat. So save those items for for the boils. Why am I able to go up these like little stairs? Why would I want to do this? Yeah, fuck it. Might as well try it. Get attacked by the Puyo Puyos. Oh. Did no damage. Uh, let's see what Earth does. I've just, I've never used any of these besides like Fire and Freeze and Spark. Oh, nice. Good amount. And let's see what Vortex does. They all do relatively the same damage, it's just the element's different, I guess. Wait, I can keep going upwards? Is there a reason I would want to keep going upwards? Oh, actually, no, I need to... <laughs> Explore! Okay, yeah, that's fair. Okay, so 
These are apparently teleportation things. How do I how do I activate them? It's when all three characters are on them, or at least two. Interesting. I'll use that so I'm not 100%. Gotcha. Benevolent Stone Giant. Deep inside the ground, the Stone Giant waits for the Blue Heart. You know what? I'll make a, a second one so I don't screw myself. Here, I'm gonna look. Oh, so but with her, I keep going. Oh, I hit that switch earlier. <laughs> this dude looks rough. Look at Rayman over here with his limbs. <laughs>
Oh, well. <laughs> Ice is not the way to go for this guy. Oh, okay. Now I know. Okay. So I need her to go back down. I may have scrambled an egg or two. Yeah, let's go. I love eggs, so that's hype. Let's go. Okay, I figured out how the teleportation works. So what you do is you put the two characters on the squares that you want to switch, and then the third person has to hit the thing to swap them. So I have to have Rudy go up the left path. And then when he reaches the midway point, he can uh, swap with Jack.
God dang it. Yo, nice. I got a bullet clip out of that. Yeah, there you go. Nice. Oh, yeah, see? Okay, yeah, I can see why if you didn't have the warp, you could be softlocked here. Making that even cheaper would be nice. I use it all the time, so <laughs> I'd be dumb not to do that. Oh, okay. So, out of curiosity, I did look up a guide for this, and apparently on the on the first floor of, like, Jack's thing is a statue I can, like, interact with, and if I beat it, I get the, the fast drop. things were worth a lot. Okay, so I gotta go back down to the first floor.
I think once I'm uh, once I'm out of this tower, I'm gonna call it a stream. It's been a very long stream at this point. Normally I only go for Oh my god, Jack, chill. 1118 is stupid amount. Uh normally I only go for about three hours and some change, but I think at this point I've gone for almost four, so. Cause the about an hour in the stream died, so. So once I'm done with the tower, I'm good for the night. Oh, no. Come on. Yeah, you love to see it. Lots of progress, yes indeed. We fought, uh, let's see, we started at, um, it was right after the wedding scene that I save and quit. So, up until now? Yeah, that's pretty good prog. I can hear it in my head. The, ens the essence of chivalry is the ultimate challenge for a swordman. You shall master the art of the fast draw. This junky statue awaits my challenge. So do you want to do it? I damn the most cringe. Yeah, it really is. What the fuck? Is this it? I'm just going to slaughter them all in three seconds. What kind of challenge is this? What? Was that the challenge? <laughs> was was that it? Oh, the lesson continues, warrior. You are not permitted to rest until you have mastered the draw. Oh, wait. Do I have a new draw here? No? 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 Just, uh... Also nice. Um... Whatever, I'll just fucking attack them. I don't. I kill these guys in one hit and they don't do any. They do like nothing. Yeah, they do nothing to me. Jack, don't give a shit. Yeah, but yeah, that, that wedding is like really rough, especially since uh, no resting is allowed. Use your sword to hold yourself up. Um, that wedding part, we found out Cecilia is only 15, so it was like kind of super fucked up. <laughs> what? What kind of challenge was this? Each one got easier than the last one. You have learned to control your fears. What? What fear? You've learned the ancient secret. The victory is in your hands. What? Are you fucking with me? What was that? Typical anime. Yeah. Creatures in here are terrified of me. <laughs> if I recall correctly, in FF15, the printed game manual even listed the characters' blood types. Yeah, that's like a weird thing that they sometimes add, like as if it matters to the any to any degree. Oh. 
Well, at least Jack is fucking buff city now. Because he's getting all this extra XP. Feel kind of bad. Do we know how many copies Wild Arms sold? Because, like, they made five of them. A tactic spinoff and a remake. So, like, clearly someone was buying these, right? Japanese superstition blood types determine compatibility. Interesting. Didn't know that. Sold modestly, but doesn't give numbers. Interesting. Well, I mean, someone bought it. Like I said, they made seven games in the franchise. Clearly someone liked it. <laughs> Although, what's kind of upsetting is that modern Sony probably won't bring it back, so. It was the hyped up game until FF7 was announced. Yeah. Divide shot has been mastered. What? What does divide shot do? All the wind was removed from the sails by that. Yeah. See, that's the thing is like, this was probably like one of the first like bigger 3D-ish JRPGs, right? Like, but then FF7 came out with like its huge epic cutscenes and you know like. The prestige of being Final Fantasy, so it already had the IP backing it. Yeah. Alright, let's see what you do. Cut HP in half. Interesting. Yeah, I'm good. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna kill y'all. How's that sound? I shouldn't have done that. I just realized what my health is. Yep, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh my god! I'm alive! Alright, accelerator. Potion berry on me! Yes! This is gnarly 3D screenshots and stuff, yeah. But what's funny is, if you look at like any of the pre-release footage of Final Fantasy VII, you'll never see any combat. They never showed off the turn-based battles. It's very funny. Side of the battle screen had some up. Yeah. Yeah, they were a lot like this. Ooh, obliterated. Rainbow smush, baby. Damn, Jack. Now you're countering? What happened during the fucking... The pirate fight earlier? Where the fuck were you during that? Lawrence had CG cutscenes, then in three discs. Yeah, for real though. A oh, Wild Arms Two is uh, it's two discs, right? I have Wild Arms Two. I never played it though. All I know is the battle theme. God, not again.
Gotcha. Until it got to PSP. Interesting. Is that one like a bigger game? Oh, what? Oh, dude, I'd be so pissed. Oh my god, actually, you know what? Um, with uh, my original copy of FF10 on PS2, uh, there was a scratch on the disc that prevented you from getting to the final dungeon of the game. Like, that was... It, because it would go outside and then crash before it could play the cutscene. So you were never able to get through it. But I don't know what I did. I, but I think I like, you know, I thought to myself, you're like, oh, maybe I'll just Windex it a bunch. That'll, that'll, that'll fix it, right? Obviously, it didn't matter, right? I'm, I'm a dumb kid, though. Who fucking knows, right? But I started mashing buttons. And eventually, the cutscene just skipped. Like it just went right, right past it, and I, I just got to go to the final dungeon. And I was like, I don't know how I did it, but I fixed it. <laughs> so I got really lucky. Oh geez, I shouldn't have done that. I just realized what my health is. Okay, thank God I got one of them at least. Thank you, Jack, for countering. <laughs> But yeah, that was that was easily one of the scarier moments because, like I said, that, that was literally the final dungeon. Had that game at release, but didn't finish it until 2017. Interesting. I actually didn't finish it until like, well, I got my copy. I want to say like, hmm, when did I get it? I want to say like 7th or 8th grade, so that would have been pre-2007. And I didn't finish it until like a car ride in high school. Because my family used to go on road trips and we had uh, a TV in the car. Um, and I could hook up my PS2 to it. So for, you know, when we're driving 10 hours straight, I played through RPGs. That's actually how I played through all of FF9 was on a car trip. Um... Look at all these dudes. Um, but uh, FF10, I finished in a car ride as well. And it was like five years after the fact. Dude, the real challenge is whatever the fuck they have going on up here. Because this is rough nuts. Come on, Jack, you want to start? Yeah, thank you. Start countering, please. Let's do it more. Thank you. We gotta start cutting their numbers down. Otherwise, we're never gonna finish this fucking fight. Stop lowering my defense. It's pissing me off. <laughs> Look at Jack. He's so mad. But he's so cute. Look at the chibi. Whew. Alright, you guys need to get the fuck out of here. I'm sick of you guys. Shout out to 113. 
the older sibling of 112. Good. Yeah, go ahead, fucking poison me. Do it. Do it, you dumb fucking goo ball. Actual booger. Yeah, you fucking regret that. Get out of here. 4200, Jesus Christ. Jack, dude, you gotta chill out, man. You're getting all this XP, it's not fair. Does Rudy have anything on his path leading up to here, or no? It says no. Yep, so... I just par for the course. Damn, they are loading me up on bullet clips, and that kind of scares me. I've gotten the one useful, missable thing Rudy has. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, is Radar required to beat the game? I doubt it, but I figured I'd ask. Okay, no. I'm getting rid of these fucking shitty cat guys right now. I'm gonna blast them to fucking Timbuktu with my gun. I'm tired of these cats. These cats with wrenches. That's fair. Shouts a two foot two four, which is just two one one twos. Maybe this is why they load me up on bullet clips, because I'm gonna be using this fucking thing the whole time. <laughs> that went a lot smoother. Oh jeez, um, I don't know if I'll make it, I don't know if I'll make it, yep, I'm not making it, nope, Rudy's dead, Rudy, no, oh wait, oh sweet baby Jesus, oh sweet baby Jesus, that's so far back, oh, This is so far back. I have to do all of Jack's shit again. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> it's really late. <laughs> and I can't do that again. I'll just come back to this another time. Oh boy. Oh fuck. <laughs> yeah. I, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm good. I'm, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna get some ice cream <laughs> to lay in my bed and cry. 
<laughs> oh boy. Oh god. Yeah, a good time to end the stream. Yeah. <laughs>